Today we have a surprise. It is a listening test. Ooh, we're going to have your regular test tomorrow, but this is a surprise listening test. Remember yesterday we had something follow directions? Well, we're going to do that today, but today's is a test. Yesterday was practice. Can you follow directions? So get this page, 251, 252. Okay, get your paper, and we're going to start on this side first, okay? Are you ready? Now, up here it says, read the poem, color the picture. We're not going to read the poem, and you know what? The only coloring you're going to do, listen carefully, only color what I say to color. Do not put anything else on this paper. No, Miss Susan, I'll only do what you tell me to do. Good, okay? So here we go. Okay, now, first, number, first one, okay? On the picture, there is a sun. Do you see where the sun is, the soul? Now, on that soul, I want you to make a smiley face. Do you know what a smiley face is, right? Right? Smiley face. Sure, Miss Susan sends them to you sometimes, right? Okay. So on the sun, on the sun, on the soul, I want you to draw a smiley face. Because we want the sun to be happy. And if the sun's happy, we're happy, right? Yes. Okay. Next one. Okay. Now there are two girls. There are two girls and a mommy, right? There's... Dad, Alex, Mom, Tina, Tanya, and their dog, Springer. Okay, now, find the girl on the right. Find the girl on the right and color her camisa red. Red, rojo, the camisa, the shirt, the shirt of the girl on the right. Color it red. Okay, you got that one? Now, Alex is holding a picture. Do you see his picture? He's holding a picture. And inside of that is something that looks like water. But you know, when you're really thirsty, water is great. But there's something that's even better when you are very thirsty. It's limonada. Limonada, when you are super, super thirsty, Limonada, oh, it's the best. So, find Alex's picture and color it so that he has limonada in his picture instead of water, okay? Make that limonada. You ready? Now, look very carefully and see if you can find the mariposa. In English, we call that a butterfly. Find the mariposa. Did you find it? When you find the mariposa, I want you to draw a triangle around it. Draw a triangle around the mariposa. Draw a triangle around the mariposa. Okay, now, on the picture, there is a pelota. There is a pelota. We call that a ball. And it's a special kind of ball. We call that a beach ball. Okay, I want you to color the beach ball. Are you listening? Color the beach ball green and blue. Green and blue. Only green and only blue. Okay, when you're, you can stop the video and move on, okay? Okay, then the last one is, there are two birds in the picture. There are two birds. Look carefully, see if you can find them. And when you find them, draw a square 
around the bird on the left. Draw a square around the bird on the left. Okay? Now, on the other side of your paper, we're here. The top part, you can do all by yourself because you're smart. Now, down below, oh, we're going to count by threes. <gasps> do you remember how to count by threes? Well, I'm not going to tell you. Well, okay, we'll do it one time. Three, six, nine, twelve. Everybody with me. Fifteen. 18, 21, 24, 27, 30, 33, 36, 39. Okay? You got that. Okay? Fill in right here. It says count by three. Count by three. Okay? Now, down here, we have money. Oh, how fun. I like money. You like money? Sure. Okay, now. In the picture, we have money. We're going to count the money, but it's all mixed up. Now, that's not a big deal because you can figure it out, right? Okay, so the first one, the first one is a five. The first one is a five. The little brown one, this is five, this is one, this is ten, this is twenty-five, and this is one, okay? Five, one, ten, twenty-five, and one. Are you ready? Now, here's what we're going to do. When we count money, we put all the stuff together, right? Because it's easier to count that way. So I will write it up on the board for you. Oh, aren't is it Miss Susan? Nice. Okay, so what do we have? We have 125. We have oh one of those. How many tens do we have? We have one ten. We have how many fives? There's one five. And how many ones? One, two. Okay, let's make sure we got them all. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so see about it? So this is your first one. Okay? Now the next one we have this one's a ten. This is a one. This is a five. And this is a one. So what do we have? We have one. 10, we have one five, and we have two ones. Let's count one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We got them all, okay? The last one is, ooh, we have a one, a five, and two twenty five. Okay? So we have a one. A five and two twenty fives. You see that? Now, let's see if you can count them. Okay? And then the last one, you're going to need your ruler for. Right? There's your ruler. And this little bird says draw a line that is 13 centimeters. 13 centimeters. So what are you going to do? You're going to find the right side of your ruler and put the line right there. Ooh, I better do it this way. Put the line right there. Right? Here's what you want to do. Put it right there. And then take your little pencil. And draw however long it is. Here's what I do. When I do that, I find the number I'm looking for first, the 13, and I draw a line. I do it that way. That's how long, and then I start there and go, I go backwards. That's how I do it, okay? So you find whatever 13 is, draw your line, and then from there go backwards, okay? But I'm not going to show you my ruler because this is the 
see how smart you are and if you can follow directions. And if I show you my rule, then you'll know what to do. So we can't do that. Okay? So there you are for today. Have fun, and we will see how well you can follow directions.